there's certainly no shortage of games in the App Store that have you tossing animals all over the place. Maybe not tossing them, it's more, it's more like touching them, dragging your finger backward, and launching them in a line. You know, with, with gravity, and it's, it's sticky sheep for the iPhone. This electronic realization of a recurring PETA nightmare was just released to the App Store by Chilingo, and it's one of those iOS games that mixes curling and billiards with miniature golf. And I, and I guess, pinball. And animal abuse. Uh, consider the sheep, Chilingo! So the idea is that you have to get these sheep onto the targets scattered across the level. They don't freaking do it on their own, so you have to knock them around with a little puppy. You touch it, launch it, and then you knock the sheep around. And you have a limited amount of shots to get all the sheep onto targets. Otherwise, it's, it's to the pound with you, Sam Sheepdog. Now, obviously, the trick is colliding with the sheep at the right angle. Not like a, not like a 90 degree angle, I mean the correct angle and velocity. And the game changes things up by throwing in different sheep varieties and bumpers and, and obstacles, and kind of like a pinball table. Now, games like this tend to succeed or fail based on their physics, and fortunately the physics in Sticky Sheep are pretty good. The sheep roll where you expect them to, your dog's speed depends on how far you pull back, that all works. Sticky Sheep is perfectly fine in that regard. But I did run into a few annoyances in this game, uh, some of which had to do with the game's performance. I experienced just a bit of slowdown at times, which can make games like this especially difficult, uh, but the bigger issue for me was the camera. You see, for some reason, it always wants to zoom in, and for some reason, I always wanted to zoom out. And so I did that. I pinched, I panned out, and as soon as my finger even got close to the edge of the screen, the game pulled back in. It was, it was like two people who just couldn't find a compromise, so we drove each other crazy until one of us decided to veto the other. And when you're the human, you know, you have the veto power. Aside from that strange little quirk, I had fun with Sticky Sheep, and it's actually a surprisingly challenging game too. I mean, because the sheep don't want to be on those targets, and frankly, who can blame them? Targets are for people who think they're too good to be in a Walmart. And there goes that sponsorship, it's Sticky Sheep for the iPhone.